Skyfox over a multi-use building left uninhabitable after a fire in Chestnut Hill. Look at the roof nearly completely burned out there. And now the people who both worked and lived inside can't even get back in. Our Hank Flynn has the story. Well, it's the weight of the water the fire department has been dumping on it throughout the morning and afternoon, plus what's left of the questionable strength of the walls and the roof. LNI has determined that this building that's burned all morning long here in Chestnut Hill to be unsafe, and business owners here and around the sides are wondering when they'll be able to get back in again. It looks pretty bad, and everything inside is wood. Yeah. So it's probably worse inside than we see from out here. I don't know. All of Chestnut Hill has seen drop by to have a look at the building that burned throughout the morning at 8427 Germantown Avenue. Locals like Phil lamented the damage to a Chestnut Hill landmark. It is. It's 100 years old or whatever. It fits in with all the rest of the buildings along here. That's why you like Chestnut Hill. Nobody was hurt, but one woman who lived there is displaced. She was assisted by Red Cross workers, and while she wouldn't talk on camera, we are told that she is staying with friends tonight. Business owners like Cynthia Fillmore of the Windfall Gallery next door told us over the phone that they're on a wait-and-see basis. They're doing a great job, but they are they are concerned about the structure, um, the the weight of the water. They're they're concerned that there could be a collapse, which is why the entire block is still blocked off. Now, Philly police opened the block back up just before five o'clock so the traffic can get up and down Germantown Avenue. Not so obviously for the building, which remains at cordoned off. Philly Fire tells us mainly for safety for all the debris out front, which will be cleared up, but they obviously don't want anything falling off onto people walking by on the sidewalk out front. There may be more answers as soon as tomorrow for business owners like Cynthia. In Chestnut Hill, Hank Flynn, Fox 29 News.